Well everyone, it's Shane Kanto, your Way Slam reviewer, and I'm here to review Human Factors, and this is a new drama from uh, writer-director Ronnie Trocker, and focuses on a mysterious home invasion triggers off a shake in a core of a cosmopolitan middle-class family and unveils the fragility of truth and power of individuals in this family. And basically what happens is there's a scare and this family moves out to their vacation home. And there's always a, a really great level of tension that Trocker's able to layer into this film. And at every moment it feels like something bad could happen. Somebody could be in the house, watching the house. And you have the perspectives of the parents the younger teenage daughter, the young boy. There's even times where, like, the camera work in this movie is really impressive, and we get, like, this really hyper-close view of their pet mouse, and watching the mouse crawl around and expecting something's going to happen to it, or the mouse is off into the bushes, and the dad comes out threateningly trying to see if anybody's out there, and we're like, something's going to happen to this mouse. And you have this tension throughout the whole entire film, almost to a level of a thriller, but this really is a drama. It is the aftermath of such a scare and how it affects the people in a family, and that's where this film really goes. And Mark Washed, who plays Jan, the father, and you have... Marta Schneider and Karen Margaret, uh, Karen Margaret Gottfriedson, and the whole rest of this cast give really fantastic performances. There's a lot of drama. There's a lot of tension between these characters. The parents, the young boy, um, seeing people outside around the house, having that suspicion, having that fear, because this was a trauma. This caused this kind of tension to keep building up and this expectation that something bad's going to happen. And throughout this film, you feel that tension. Now, you know, the film builds up all this tension and it never really feels like it fully goes anywhere with it. It is still very much just like, you know, human drama going on. And I guess that could make the film feel a little unsatisfying by the end. But, you know, they deal with very human and relatable things, nothing particularly crazy or interesting outside of obviously them being afraid of this home invasion. You see the teenage daughter at a party and people doing stupid things and always being on edge. That's the thing. All these characters are on edge and that builds up the tension and makes this an engaging viewing experience, even if by the end it might not go anywhere specifically with that. It might all be a red herring, but you feel the tension nonetheless while you watch it, and Trocker's able to really achieve that with his direction. And in the end, I think this is still an engaging and enthralling experience worth your time. But those are my thoughts on Human Factors. Let me know what you think, and let's talk some movies. But thank you, as always, for tuning in and supporting your Wasteland Reviewer.